all works out. The problem is from the tiny little. Yeah. Well, part of the design is going to have to be similar to a uh, uh, power antenna. The arm is able to, using the switch, switch 16, with uh, momentary, set to momentary outputs, we can get the arm to go up and down as we push the buttons to whatever position we want to stop it at. And there's a limit at each end so that the motor actually shuts itself off when it reaches the physical limit. And we have on the other side, it's finally been repaired. He's pro. The computer broke. And new additions. Mm. Wanna buy a watch? The carpet is hell for, for two to three legs. The carpet is hell for well, Is it for two to three legs? Well, yeah, because it gets stuck on the way back up. Yeah, the pile on the carpet oh, will affect okay. the middle foot, right? So it, it's got a pull to it as it's holding back up. Because he's, he's 140 pounds. So you got to keep in mind all that weight's on that middle leg. You know. Oh! So because of the amount of weight when the carpet like bunches up inside, it slows down that pull, so it's got that resistance. It's just like if you're pulling... Um, That's swivel casters, right? So yeah. Swivel caster has to be able to swivel into the right position. So Think of yourself sitting on an office tile, chair. It's no problem. And you've got the office chair on a tile floor or a hardwood floor. You can you know, roll easily from one to the other, but you're on a carpet floor. Especially these places. This hotel goes back to the 70s. And um, yes, thank you, darling. Th these places go back to the 70s. So these carpets have got like so much crud in them. Um, he's always had a hard time in this particular hotel. Um, he, he had a great time in Montreal. Montreal was all hardwood floors. Mm -hmm. Right? Uh, go on, camera. Camera? Right there. Okay. So some of the, um, two of the devices we've got set up in the head are this uh, Roman scanner antenna. And we haven't tried it since we moved in here, so. Ah! Come on. <laughs> Very stuttery, but. See what uh, happened oh, is. Uh, oh, rip. Ding, ding. <laughs> what had happened is the first one we had done. Um, it got uh, smacked, and it, it completely shattered the base of that head. I mean, the whole thing was just destroyed. It got smacked and snapped off, so we had to completely rebuild it. And the second version is a little touchier than the first one. It goes down beautifully. It goes down great, yeah. <laughs> Before it went up great and came down, you know, it had a hard time coming down. So you want to go back from two to three here? Two to three. This is mine. This is Melissa. Melissa is our two's godmother. This is my Spank your butt. If Martin and I die, Melissa will be taking our two home. Yes. So we're watching her closely this weekend. Hey, she looks good in her eggs. <laughs> what? <laughs> you know, you have the top off. 
<laughs> We've got uh, plenty of room in the head. We were, we've been thinking of uh, IR2. <laughs> Turn around. Thank you. Um, like we've got the doors out now. I've got bug eyes in front of me. <laughs> Yeah, what else have we got? We've got uh, an empty door here, which would be his lightsaber launcher. Cool. Yeah. I'd love to see that. Launch Nerf well, lightsabers or something with it. Well, you guys actually get to see the planes take off and land. Yeah. yeah. And then the door in the center, which uh, we've seen him use as the drink dispenser. You on, are not. Cars, which well, you are know. not. What I'm thinking of that is that's the kind of uh, multi-purpose device. So we make three or four different things that can so be dropped in and plugged in. Well I just have this extreme fear that someone's going to spill something on it. Uh, uh, other little panels here which uh, we're going to use mostly for access for um, devices and stuff. And then over here uh, eventually we get this little uh, repair arm that he used like in the first movie yeah. to, uh, I'm not, I'm not to repair stuff on the X-Wing when it got uh, shot at. And then down in the body, we've got an open panel here, panel here, panel here, so we can do his electro prod and his uh, mm -hmm. little, little circular saw, whatever else we want to do. The, the big challenge here in Toronto that many of our friends have given us is, is they want to see him go up in flames on stage, and we're like, no. no. <laughs> you, can do, you can make one of those, like, you know that thing that he tries to open the door? The answer is no. Oh, when he the plugs pool. in and throws it? Yeah, that's, that's in there. That's already there. Oh, it is in there? Yep. Did you, uh, you probably didn't see it because it's in the starting socket, which we can switch on and off remotely as well. And the one next to it shows that it runs. So we can use that for uh, plugging in whatever gadgets we want to do, whether we want to have give them a, like a little 12 volt vacuum cleaner so you can clean up or uh, whatever. And then here in the center is where his uh, recharge plug in is. We'll just plug a 12 volt battery charger into that. Well, I think that's all of. How's that, Alex? Sounds good. And the books.